When we look back at history, has there ever been any examples that we could see as people having wrong beliefs about something on a mass level? Maybe, even today, we could be wrong about some things. Why is it natural to assume that our social beliefs are correct? Look, you don't know how the sun is made. The buildings, societies around you, you're immersed in it. And it must have taken some pretty intelligent people to build this stuff, <laughs> right? You must be pretty smart. How about an airplane? We live in an incredible, incredible era, right? You can have a video phone where you talk to somebody and they're not even in the same room as you and you're looking at them having a conversation. We live in an amazing society. We don't know how it works, do we? We have no clue how most of this stuff is working. Those of us that are more educated have maybe a decent idea of how stuff is working, and still we have no clue how this thing is working. As a result, the natural tendency is to give authority to society. We give them authority. We let society dictate our beliefs to us. It's very easy to give up your concepts of reality to society and to get in a habit of looking to other people for how to live. Most people in the world walk through life in a walking daze. They don't know what their values are. They do not have a concept of their own values. They do not have a concept of who they are. They don't know what they want out of life. And they're being tinkered with by other people who do. That's what modern society does. Now, if we tell the truth, can they hear that? They can't hear that. They don't want to hear that. That's some shit people are not supposed to hear. Because if they hear that, they freak the fuck out, right? And even if they hear me say, like, he's mean. Like, that's mean, what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? But what's the truth? Like, fuck emotions. What's the fucking truth? What's the truth, homie? The reason why is because there's some shit people are not meant to hear. There's some shit people are not meant to see. You're not supposed to know that. sarcastic in my videos. Uh, I say a lot of shit that's like, you know, over the top sometimes, uh, fucking crazy. You're not really sure if I'm serious or not. Why do I do that? The reason is I don't have a lot of tolerance for bullshit group motherfucking thing. Uh, in school, they teach you how to be smart, right? Uh, kind of. School teaches you how to memorize, uh, you know, ways to do mathematics. Teach you how to read a book, maybe, to spell. Uh, teaches you to memorize where a country is. That's good shit, man. Look, there's a lot of good stuff in school. We know that. Am I being sarcastic? Am I not? Who the fuck knows? Who the fuck cares? Why? Because <laughs> you have to develop independent judgment. You have to see the world through your own two eyes. You gotta put yourself in a situation that you don't totally understand. And when you do that, although it may not feel good in the moment, there's a deeper reward that you get over time. But that's why the journey of it is so fucking fun. Because it's, not, it's, it's, an, it's, a, uh, it's a pursuit and environment and a sort of thing where you can actually keep putting yourself out of your comfort zone and growing as a person. But if you never push out of your comfort zone, what happens to your brain? Autopilot, atrophy. You just do the same thing again and again. You see the world through your eyes, nobody else's eyes. Not your friend's eyes, not society's eyes, your eyes. And this comes from developing that muscle up in your head. School taught you the skills of what? Memorization, fitting in, not necessarily standing out. Maybe for some people that an exceptional teacher, that's not the case, right? But for a lot of people, that is the case. Teaches you great skills to be a factory worker. Is that what you want? So, cultivate.
cultivate the skill of seeing the world through your own eyes. You're going to get social feedback telling you you can't. You're going to get social feedback telling you that you are not good enough. You're going to have a million different things up in your head telling you why you can't do it. Social feedback is going to tell you, motherfucker, you can't do it. You have to think for yourself. You shouldn't need to ask for permission. You should be self abused You shouldn't be looking for a reaction. You should feel good, man, because life is fucking short. You get it?